Thank you for your interest in these incredible machines. They have supported us in war and peace. Let us remember those heroic crews too. The Avro 504 was a first World War biplane aircraft made by the Avro Aircraft Company and under license by others. Production during the war totaled 8,970 and continued for almost 20 years, making it the most produced aircraft of any kind that served in any military capacity during the First World War. More than 10,000 were built from 1913 until production ended in 1932. Small numbers of early aircraft were purchased by the Royal Flying Corps and the Royal Naval Air Service prior to the start of the First World War and were taken to France when the war started. One of the RFC aircraft was the first British aircraft to be shot down by the Germans on the 22nd of August 1914. The Renards used four 504s to form a special flight in order to bomb the Zeppelin works at Friedrichshain on the shores of Lake Constance. Three set out from Belfort in northeastern France on the 21st of November 1914, carrying four 9 kg bombs each. While one aircraft was shot down, the raid was successful, with several direct hits on the airship sheds and the destruction of the hydrogen generating plant. Following the end of the war, while the type continued in service as the standard trainer of the RAF, large numbers of surplus aircraft were available for sale, both for civil and military use. More than 300504KS were placed on the civil register in Britain. Used for training, pleasure flying, banner towing, and even barnstorming exhibitions, civil 504s continued flying in large numbers until well into the 1930s. The RAF's 504NS were finally replaced in 1933 by the Avro Tutor, with small numbers continuing in civilian use until 1940, when seven were impressed into RAF service, where they were used for target and glider towing. The 504 was the first British aeroplane to strafe troops on the ground, as well as the first British aircraft to make a bombing raid over Germany. It was also the first Allied aeroplane to be downed by enemy anti-aircraft fire, and was the first aircraft flown by many future aces, including Billy Bishop. The 504 is easily recognizable because of the single skid between the wheels, referred to as the toothpick in the RAF. Thanks, you have reached the end of the journey. Take care, see you pretty soon. Safe flight.